For this experiment, you will need 0.1 gram of magnesium, 6 milliliters of 1 molarity of hydrochloric acid, 2 paperweights and 1 balance scale, 0.15 to 0.18 grams of yeast, 5 milliliters of hydrogen peroxide, 2 clamps and 2 ring stands, 2 30 milliliter beakers and 2 rubber stoppers with 2 openings each, a total of 4 stopcocks or valves, and a total of 6 syringes, a pair of 20 milliliter, 12 milliliter, and 6 milliliter syringes. In addition, one plastic tube to connect the syringes. Your setup should look like this. Once the ring stands and clamps are set up, seal one of the 30 milliliter beakers with a rubber stopper. Make sure the beaker is completely sealed to avoid any leakage. Place a paperweight on a balance scale and tear the scale. Measure anywhere between 0.15 to 0.18 grams of yeast. Use a paperweight to insert the yeast inside one of the openings of the beaker. the valves into the rubber stoppers. Fill a syringe with 5 milliliters of hydrogen peroxide and insert it into one of the beakers. Follow the same procedures for magnesium and hydrochloric acid. Discard the first two syringes, which will be filled with air. The third syringe will hold the pure gases. Keep the valves closed when no syringe is in place and open to collect the air and gases. Oxygen and hydrogen are held together by the soap bubbles. When ignited, a drop of water has been created. 